Oh, wait, wait, pause, pause, pause. I can see why you brought this video you to are, me. You are a trained uh, martial artist. I mean, I don't know if I should reveal it on the show. I, I maybe we shouldn't even include this edit because most people don't know about my training, but... Oh, what's that? And you regularly have the supervision of a medic on set. Right behind your camera, there is yeah. a medic, just yeah. in case. Yeah, I, uh... Oh, what's that? Mm. Bam! <laughs> Kazam! I'm so dramatically out of shape that I did genuinely kind of hurt my arm. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, and welcome back to Jarvis Johnson Gold, oh! the premium channel that is free. Um, it is, it is free. But if you're watching this, you're a martial artist and also premium. Today, I'm joined by my brother in arms, Jordan Adika. Biological brother in arms. <laughs> Biologically, we have the same arms. Biological long wingspan in arms. Um, and today, we're going to be watching a Odd One Out Jubilee video called Five Black Belts Versus Two Fakes, which I specifically selected Jordan for his specific set of skills, in fact. Mm, a passing interest in UFC that I stopped engaging in maybe four years ago. But it's in your heart. Yeah, and of course my training, which we <laughs> <laughs> Of course we did address the training. Hacha! Hello, it's me, Ad Jarvis, cutting into the video with my vicious strike. Are you sick of chopping and kicking your way through all the random stuff that you can buy online? Are you having a hard time finding cool quality goods while also supporting small businesses? That's where today's sponsor, Bespoke Post, comes in. Bespoke Post is a monthly membership club delivering awesome boxes of top shelf goods from under the radar brands. Every month they introduce their members to cool new products from outdoor gear, barware, home and kitchen goods, clothing, and more, all based on a preference quiz that you fill out. And their box lineup changes every month, so there's always new stuff to check out. Bespoke Post searches for the best products so you don't have to, and 90% of the products in their boxes come from small businesses right here in the US of A. Like for example, this Vermont maple syrup, and I know what you're thinking, what are you gonna use maple syrup for? Well, I've also got some pancake mix and a cast iron skillet to go with it. So I'm making pancakes. I also got this cool weekender bag to put my pancakes in. Every box has around $70 in value, but only costs $45. Every month, based on your preferences, you'll get a box assigned to you. And before it's shipped, you also get a preview of what comes inside and you can decide to keep it, swap it for a different box or skip the month entirely for no charge. So essentially you only pay for what you want. Sign up today at bspk.me slash Jarvis. That's my name and use promo code Jarvis20 at checkout to get 20% off your first monthly box when you sign up. Thanks again to Bespoke Post for sponsoring this video. Butcha! The real reason I brought you here, Jordan, is uh, because this video started playing. I knew I had to have you react to this. <laughs> that is so interesting to me because that says a lot about our relationship. This is going to give me an insight into what you think of me. It's really just that I wanted to share a moment with you. Ready? And... You were right to bring this to me. I just, it comes, it starts so strong. Are they going to be just showing off their moves and having other people judge whether or not they're a black belt? How is the person who's a fake black belt going to fake this? It's literally going to just be them like doing a, a, a half cartwheel. <laughs> like, yeah. Ta -ta. Doing it like uh, they're like meditating and they're like, I'm actually fighting in my mind like <laughs> Goku does. Actually, uh, the greatest version of combat is prevention yeah, i actually avoid <laughs> fights uh which is the way that i keep myself safe oh you fight with your weapons <laughs> okay yellow belt we brought together seven black belts <laughs> you could take a guess at the <laughs> it's probably this one right <laughs> <laughs> yeah the first thing is like <laughs> i am a black belt i'm a black belt i'm a black belt i am a black belt I'm a black belt. I'm a black belt. I am a black belt. The girl with the blue hair, I fully believe. She could kick my ass. <laughs> Not only because she almost killed me through my screen with dual swords. No. <laughs> I guess we'll do it real quick. It's the most generic thing. How long everybody's been training, what your martial art is. We can yeah. just go straight to sit on the line. My name's Andre. I've been training for eight years. I do Taekwondo. I feel like they're going to do... The person who's the fake black belt is going to have picked the easiest martial art to fake and i feel like that's a huge insult on whatever that martial art is yeah that's a that's a roast on i almost said one not gonna <laughs> somebody in the comments is gonna be mad i think that it's always a weird vibe when someone says like 
hey, I do this, and then the next person after them says exactly the same thing, as if to say, I couldn't come up with anything else to say. Oh, yeah, me. I also do taekwondo, yes, as well. What a little dink! I also have done taekwondo for eight years. I do waekwondo, actually. Oh, tae? Taekwondo? That's my homie. It's little taekwondo. What's good, tae? Taekwondo for about a decade, more than that. Oh, she was like, Damn, he, I raised, I see your eight years and I raise you a decade or more. My name's Keith Hudson and I've been training for six years now in karate and taekwondo. Okay, he gave the Japanese pronunciation of karate. But that could be, that could be preparation, you know? That could be preparation. Victoria, I've been training for like over 10 years now and I- I, I don't have anything that I've been training for 10 years. I feel so small in this moment. I don't remember 10 years. I'm, I'm semi-cynical I didn't exist. The only experience I have with somebody exercising a black belt was when I acted up as a kid. If you know what I'm saying. Yeah, hell yeah. You were attacked. I was attacked by martial artists. <laughs> okay, good. sick, dude. Gloria, I've been training for like over 10 years now, and I do Kaji Kimbo. I came on here to like bring representation to the style. Okay, first of all, that's sick. I feel like if she was the imposter, that would be so fucked up. But Please I've never start. heard of that martial art, and she just wants to raise awareness to it. You've never heard of it? Oh my god. Jo uh, You're typing. Something. Hmm? You're typing right now. Yeah, it's exercise for my fingers to maintain my training. No. Could the uh, that one is a hybrid martial art from Hawaii. So. Oh. Um, cringe. That's pretty impressive, actually, that you knew that. Jirana, I've been doing it for like 15 years. Uh, taekwondo. Oh, there's so many Taekwondo mm. heads here. Mm, interesting. So many people are doing the thing the first one said. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's actually eight imposters. I agree. My name is Casey. I have been doing Hapkido for nine years. My name is Anthony Cruz, and I've been doing Jiu-Jitsu for about 10 years. A lot of Taekwondo, though, people, huh? I know. What, yeah, what, I was next. What got you all into martial arts? I played a He's lot of fighting games as a kid. So get, pop, 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 hitting stuff. Uh, one day, I kicked the table mother was furious she was like we have to take this energy somewhere else and the next day she enrolled me in a taekwondo gym that is very fast work from mom she was a, uh, a platinum belt she has a black belt in uh parenting i guess <laughs> in love i feel like every time i encounter a problem in my life um it takes me way longer than a day to immediately solve it. I don't even know if you can sign up for martial arts course in a day. I didn't know you could. A lot of Jackie Chan growing up, and I was like, I want to join like karate, like a whatnot kung fu. She keeps saying like whatnot and or so. Like she's like 10 years or so, karate and whatnot. Well, yeah, the, I mean, the famous thing about people that do martial arts is they're not particularly disciplined or specific. <laughs> yeah, it's famously a loosey-goosey art style. The huge guy absolutely does jujitsu there's no way he's in spectacular shape he's that or he's like triathlete i kind of am not sure if the imposters are going to be a unique martial arts style in this list or one of the thousand people doing taekwondo go my dad put me in it to like learn self-defense mm, my dad did aikido when i was younger and i said that i wanted to be like him dad didn't want to be, want me to be a ballerina so that's why he put me in hapido what's wrong with wanting to, to be a ballerina <laughs> I also feel like there's going to be a bias as to like how people um, look, you know? Like, oh, absolutely. Yeah, know. that's the. I mean, at a certain point, not unlike martial arts, which I do know a lot about. Sorry, I'm just Googling something unrelated. <laughs> you just Googled the definition for martial arts, so you didn't even need yeah. that. I felt like Anthony was suspicious because the way he was like instigating the conversation. I mean, he was just like. A lot of Taekwondo heads, huh? Personally, as the mole, I was offended that Anthony called me out. <laughs> uh, <gasps> Dang. Oh my god, Andre. No. Bye. I'm gonna talk fighting games with you later. He didn't even do any of his moves and they were like, get out of here. I know, he didn't even get to power up. They were like, no one has ever studied a martial art because of a fighting game. Get out of here. Dude. The martial arts round. You will eat. Oh, that was a sick edit. Whoa! They tried, there's a second form. <laughs> well, like they literally did. They were like, <gasps> yo, dude, the editor had a field day with this. You each have about 30 seconds to demonstrate your martial arts and prove to the others that you are. This seems like it's going to be the obvious tell, right? Anything I'm not going to throw it, don't worry. Okay, all right, all right. <laughs> oh my 
my god. Go back at the, as soon as he says, you'll have to prove it. Look at the first girl in the row. <laughs> Seconds to demonstrate your martial arts and prove to the others that you are a black belt. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I will. <laughs> Anything I'm not gonna that... throw it, don't worry. Okay, all right. <laughs> I kind of think it would be interesting if we tried to guess the role that the imposters have. I think they could be stunt actors, you know what I mean? Yes, yeah, good point. They could have stunt combat choreography. Yeah, yeah, like they could know the choreography but not the actual art. That's like saying, like, I'm a historian, pick the fake one. It's like, well, I have a degree, but I've, I've, I've been an archaeologist for 30 years. That's, I feel, how they often get away with it in the odd, odd one out things. Because it'll be like, I'm not actually a dog owner. This is my brother's dog that I spend a lot of time with. And I'm like, okay, well... I foster. I don't have the same dog forever. I'm not a twin. This is my brother who was born a, like six months after me due to some sort of medical <laughs> miracle and we grew up together as if we were twins and it's like okay well technically you got me <laughs> i'm just saying i would be much more impressed if it was like somebody who like just off the street was like i bet i could convince some people i know taekwondo they they should get a martial art if they pull this off and i would pay good money to see that competition <laughs> Pause! Pause! You say pause like she was doing like a forbidden jutsu and she like we were just like uh, <laughs> yeah you know pause, pause. <laughs> right as we're like coming like towards you and then they pause pause this is not allowed then she does a bunch of like sword slashes and then like trunks you know like I get cuts in half and you just see me like yeah yeah no this girl's badass pause 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 I will award her a black belt for this alone. <laughs> I don't care if she has been given one before. Oh! Let's go! Jarvis. Okay. I'm gonna... Are you about to say she's super sci Saiyan Blue right now? I'm gonna... <laughs> yeah, she's SSGSS, I believe. The yelling... Yeah. ...does not strike me as very martial artsy. It strikes me as stunt choreography. And it's a lot of killing blows as well. <laughs> that was so bad, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, criticizing yourself is very martial arts. Yeah, she's like, sorry, that was kind of bad. Did you not see the part where you threw the sword? <laughs> that is uh, future trunks right there. Super Saiyan Blue. Like, as if, as if that she is, like, swooping the air, her fists, her punches are moving that fast, right? Her form seemed kind of, like, basic, and I thought since she did, like, Taekwondo, she would do, like, a lot of kicks and stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna talk as if I'm teaching a normal class. Can you come into, this is called a garden jiu-jitsu. It's one of the most, uh, it's one of the martial arts that teaches you how to be offensive on the ground. I'm gonna teach what's called a triangle choke, and to do a triangle choke, it's a very, it's a very fundamental process, but you use it from white to black belt. He showed a jiu-jitsu move and it seemed like very rehearsed and it was something that anyone could essentially learn that if they went to a couple classes or trained yeah maybe he uh played a jiu-jitsu teacher in a tv show almost like a jiu-jitsu teacher of some kind he seemed to know the move and was able to teach it sus <laughs> right like a, a, a jiu-jitsu style it seemed and now i have this my leg go across the neck pull the head down and pitch my hips up and that's it and if he doesn't tap he goes to sleep in six seconds <laughs> So if he wants to do jujitsu with somebody and doesn't instruct them, he'll kill them. That is, yeah. <laughs> if they need to be guided through it or they're going to panic and pass out. You think I'm an imposter? Watch me wring this, the life out of this man, yeah. Mr. JP, the practice partner. The way that she's smiling during it kind of feels like Oh shit, and they've got this guy, he rehearsed this with her. That's why they have a partner. <laughs> oh, now the hair. They've got Ip Man sound effects, dude. This this feels like those five minute crafts videos about like self-defense. <laughs> hey! hey! He's gone. Oh, no. He's gone. He's gone. <laughs> You're doubting me? Okay, well let me decapitate the man. Yeah, he's been ended actually. Ah. <laughs> Fatality of the Becca. <laughs> okay, I don't love the music choices. I hope they're appropriate for the 
region of you know the martial art because I feel like it could they could just be playing generic music. He'd done it to JP. He broke JP in half. <laughs> Even though Adriana, really? What? Oh, oh, sus. Sus then. That's you interesting. Sus, then. I wonder if he's going to explain it. I have a lot of friends that have learned how to staff spin, saber spin, or stunt actors, but they're not black belts. He has similar theory to us. Inter he's, he's working off the same theory, okay. But he might be one himself, you know? If you, I mean, he has a lot of friends that do it. <laughs> the pot calling the kettle black belt. He just did a basic demonstration, and he even used the words, everyone uses this from white belt all the way up to black belt. Did I think he did jujitsu? Absolutely. Did I think he was a black belt? No. Wow! And oh, dude, and he voted for the most threatening right. competitor. Can we clap? Oh. <laughs> I wish I had a great hair like that. Everyone feels confident that you already caught them all. You can end the game now. But if the majority has doubt, the game will continue. Please raise your hand if you want to continue playing the game. Interesting. Because I have respect for you, I, I am the mole. Is he 15 steps ahead? Is he about to reverse my attack? Wait. He was the only one who decided not to continue and then removed himself? So odd. What was his, uh, was his showcase the um, not quite making it through the boards on the first hit? Yeah, and then making it through the boards, yeah. Okay, I mean, that's viable, yeah. Huh? What? <laughs> Also, the way that he's doing it, what is what is this honor that he is holding on to? He may be like a, a yellow belt or something. And the fact that he is deceiving them is like against that code or something. Or but something. like, again, how, why would he be here in the first place if like that was against his code? <laughs> he didn't know he was lying. <laughs> yeah, he's like, oh no, I'm, I'm the bullshit. I am not a black belt. Not yet. But I want to be. Shoop. Shoop swish. What is this? Soup, soup switch, Jordan. This is so odd. Does he think they can give him a black belt? <laughs> yeah. Uh, he's acting all coy. He's like, I mean, I'm not a black belt yet. Can I have the black belt, please? <laughs> I don't that? feel comfortable deceiving any of you guys. After seeing their moves, he's like, these people can, can, will kick my ass. <laughs> yeah, like, holy shit. I need to get out while I still can. You guys are fantastic. And I can't lie. I can't. So... I humbly apologize. This is so weird. So where are you at now? Yeah. Yeah, what belt are Tell you? Tell us the whole story. I just got my first advanced belt. So now they're interviewing him about his experience, I guess. And now he's just coming fully clean. This is so strange. Am I right in thinking that like, because he revealed himself after they assessed that there, there, were, there were still some left? They now have to kick somebody out, right? Yeah, so I guess they got to vote him out. Imagine if he's a real black belt. Well, Jarvis, unlike me, you're not a black belt. Did I show you my training? <laughs> It's really a test to figure out who the two fake black belts are. Because if you're a true black belt, you would see through his technique. I trained during the pandemic. I started training back in martial arts in 2019. I was a smoker and a drinker through my 20s. Is this like a confessional? What is going on? I... What's happening? Well, I guess they have to fill the time, right? He was overcome with so much guilt that he is just telling his whole life story. Wait, how do you start doing martial arts over pandemic did he do it at home yeah i don't know did he learn like on youtube if you're learning martial arts at home just give yourself a black belt we have martial arts at home this guy's martial arts at home <laughs> and oh my god what huh i i'm i'm sad now actually what hold happened? on i needed to turn my life around and <sighs> God, okay, well, I feel bad about every joke I made leading up to this. I think uh, this is cute. I like this. What an it's honorable cute. Dude. I feel, I mean, good for him, but I'm, man, this is so odd. <laughs> what if, what if he was not an imposter? Though? What if he was no. like a, this is 7D chess. What if they all drop out to give him the money as a gift? I was thinking, what if when they hug him, they've exposed their back and he stabs them in the back and teaches them a lesson <laughs> about weak points. Destroy your enemy completely, Sun Tzu. Yeah, never show weakness. I wanted to be honest. I felt it here. 
This game is fun, and I didn't mean to just, you know. <laughs> this game is fun. I'm having a great time. I'm having a ball, and you're also talented. <laughs> I don't want to make fun of him. It would be patronizing not to. We're, we're making fun of everyone. Yeah, we're making fun of everyone, but also, like, hopefully we're laughing with him, because this is an absurd thing, and I wish the best for this man. You guys are so good. <sighs> Man, shut up, your time's up. <laughs> All right, keep it, keep it moving. The, the room's about to turn red. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, there is, unfortunately, there is only one thing we can do. And they just like slice him. Oh my God, Keith, Keith, you've been so open. I really respect that. And, and it, it was the honorable choice, but. Honestly, we really appreciate you being so open with us. And that's why it's so difficult to stab your ass in the back. You're gone, buddy. Everyone did a heart. No heart. This is um very poetic. Oh no! Again, we do have. Continue! <laughs> so please raise your hand if you want to continue playing the game. Imagine if you're the mole. Imagine if you're the other mole and you see Keith do what he did and you're like, I'm still in this baby. <laughs> I'm I in it to the end. I mean, who are you betting on? If it's, if there's still. Mine, I think I'm going with Jiu Jitsu Jones. I think he was the sussy. Um. Yeah, I think that, that that makes sense to me. Do you think they have to like fight to the death now or something? Like, what is the next yeah. round going to be? <laughs> Especially if one of them is, is is the imposter and they just get the shit beaten out of them. Yeah, when you have to fight, they'd be like, actually, I don't want to do this. Oh, uh, the only reason I want to continue is you did say like, oh, I haven't, as soon as I mentioned like sidekick technique, yeah. like, oh, well, I haven't done it in a long time. So no. I don't know. The form was like a very basic kind of color belt form because and in Taekwondo, oh, like in my in my studio it's second degree wait what's your style though my style oh shoot like honestly like, like you're... is it like maintenance space if i don't do a sidekick for 10 years do i am i do i drop down you might sprain something if you haven't did a sidekick in that long but i'm still a black belt it's not like a driver's license right i feel like it is like a driver's license do you have to renew your black belt i don't know i've be, been busy you know how people complain about like old people uh driving and stuff and it like being a danger or something like that to people complain about old people having black belts <laughs> old people having a license to kill my master was never the most professional i just think when victoria asked you what style you did it did take yeah, nah. you a while to respond because it's just right away oh i do have keto so she really screwed up here this is gonna look really bad if she's not the imposter i think she's a black belt i don't doubt her at all oh really because she's like they were like, what's your style? And she was like, ooh, what is my style? If you're a black belt, you can easily explain how to do a side kick. Yeah. Side kick is a basic kick. It is, right? but my kick was never as good as No, 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 it doesn't, it doesn't matter the yeah, height, yeah, as long as you can. It's like muscle memory. <laughs> okay. That was good. She did the side kick. Did you hear her rea reaction? It was like, okay, you called that a side kick? <laughs> Yeah, so okay. the biggest thing is really just like explaining technique. Yeah. Right? I forgot the one on the furthest right. She had a terrible demonstration. I forgot how bad that was. She was just chuckling and... Yeah, she was like laughing through it. Yeah, it was like first level stage combat where she started a motion and then stopped because he hadn't gotten to her yet. What if the reason it's two fakes is because Keith lied about being a black belt to Jubilee and he was lying to both the show and the group and that's why he like gave himself away I'm, a, I'm an artist of the hacky sack so it's just like it's not to be like offensive yeah, of or course. anything no, no, no. it's just you know what i mean it's, it's just game. things that like that we think of yeah of no you're like... pointing them out i'm not good but i am a black belt <laughs> yeah she's like you, no you're accurate like i am bad so yeah <laughs> uh andre and keith and like the guys i thought they were the moles you know we're all professional in a sense oh. I'm not too sure of Victoria. This seems stressful. They're wrong. They're wrong. I like, I don't have any knowledge of that. I don't know martial arts and shit. Sorry. Yeah, it's like pretty unfair of you to ask me about my black belt because I do not have one. I felt bad because like we attacked Jessica, but I asked her what martial arts style she did and she like stuttered and she didn't know. And I was like, isn't that why we're here? <laughs> It's a game, y'all. It's a game. Please raise your hand if you want to continue playing the game. If the lights turn green, that means you have voted out the mole. There's so few of them, they have to have voted out the mole. But imagine if they haven't. Imagine if, I mean, at least it's slice in the half. I would think it's a girl on the right if there's anybody left. If the lights turn red, that means the mole is still in the box and you lose. All right.
I mean, there's three of them. <laughs> Good job. Real black belts. Will the fake black belts both please step forward and reveal yourselves in three, two, one. Oh. Oh. Shit. Oh my god, oh. it's for you! Man, that's lame. Damn it. That's like the worst case. I mean, other than the fact that Keith fell on his own sword, mm -hmm. whenever they get one of the fakes immediately, that sucks. What even gave him away? He's a, that... They literally just profiled him. <laughs> my dad was a black belt, and when we were young, uh, he put me in the school in Sherwood, Arkansas. Danny Drinks, Living Defense Martial Arts Dojo. Uh, yeah, yes, so I do martial arts. Uh... I've like, I'm self-taught with like weapons and everything. Oh my God, I can't believe we weren't able to identify the black nerd. I don't think that gives him away because he was talking about fighting games. Teaching himself the weapons, referencing anime and video games. I feel like she should have been easier to vote out early on, you know? The girl in the middle. She, like, she clearly did martial arts. It was like the level, the tier that was a question mark. Whereas I could have, I could have like reluctantly accepted blue hair girl was a stunt performer or something, you know? I'm glad we got to the bottom of this today. I think it was pretty obvious, Jordan, why I chose you for this video. Thank you, everybody, for joining me here on Driver Strats and Gold. And remember, stay gold, everybody. <laughs>